y'all what's up chad right coming to you here once again on the channel team righteous and today we have an almost brand new 2022 gsxr 750 in the house uh customer brought it to us was having some issues we fixed those issues for him and the price was way lower than what he was expecting so he said well while you're while i've got it here or whatever he said i got this exhaust that i want you to put on for me i said cool we can get it put on bring it by we'll get it installed for you i said by the way i said i mean you're putting a new exhaust on there we got to tune this thing right and he said well what's that going to run us and we let him know what the price was and he was good with that too so we're going to put it on the dyno today too uh before we get to that though y'all saw in uh, one of the last videos we had kind of an explosion with uh with dragonfly here but she's back already it took just a couple of days has some spare parts the uh sprocket hub and wheel here yeah they uh took a little bit of a beating so that was the results of it but just so you know the brox cush drives they held up they uh did not get destroyed any with that what they're going on so everything was good somebody else back here is trying to get in the video say hi Kylie. So anyways, I know y'all are tired of hearing me talk. Let's look at this bike here. hear that before we go in here and throw it on the dyno though check this right here out so uh a few lights on of course you gotta get that but we got a c44 and c46 flashing so we got an f5 light that's on so so those of y'all that may have done an exhaust in the past or looking to do an exhaust in the future <clears throat> you're gonna have the code for c44 and c46 that is your exhaust servo which is the butterfly that's inside your exhaust we don't have that no more and we got rid of the box and the cables that runs all of that so it's no longer needed we got rid of it. got a code for it we also have a code for the oxygen sensor we don't need that on here because we're not running the narrowband uh, oxygen sensor that the stock ecu runs we're going to tell the bike here in a minute on the dyno what we need it to do and what we want it to do and it doesn't matter what it reads because none of that's gonna matter anyways so we got rid of that and that's what the code is on for as well so if you're looking to do an exhaust be sure to uh hit us up we can get it on the dyno and get it tuned or if you can't make it here to tuscany alabama you can ship it to your ecu in the mail and we can flash your ecu so we've done a couple of these bikes right here in the past with cat deletes and slip-ons so now we're gonna get to do it with the yoshimir full exhaust and see how it does here today on the dyno like i said it's looking super good super clean i definitely can't wait to get the plastics back on because uh, of course a bike without plastics i'm not a big fan of the bikes without the plastics uh some people ride them around out right there and they're super into that stuff but to me it's definitely got to be on there anyways shout out to more mafia we got the uh the camera girl shirt on the day can't really see yet i don't know if you can see the camera girl back there on the back she's riding the bike anyways we got that on the day but we're gonna get to this thing right here see how much power we can make out of it all right so here's where we're starting off at 131 and a half horsepower a very very strong stock uh 2022 gsxr 750 so we're gonna go through this thing here though and tune it see if we can get some more out of it all right y'all so we got our ecu flash here got the 57 motorsport sticker on it this right is the first flash but i'm just gonna show you come with me there kylie uh where it goes so if you have one of these bikes 2011 to 2050 i guess until they just decide to stop making them gsxr 600 or 750 all you have to do 
take your seat off, take the seat off, lift the tank up, and uh, there'll be a bracket that's right here. You have three bolts that are in it, and your ECU sits down in here. It sits down here like this right here. And so you take that out, put it in a box, put all your information on there, get in contact with us, and ship it to us so we can get your ECU flashed for you. Alright, so now that we got the ECU flash, take this right out. We don't have no more MI lights on. Got all the lights cleared and everything, so it's now ready to start making some more holes. See how much power we're gonna gain here and keep making some adjustments uh, going here forward. See if we can get some real power out of this thing. Discount code Team Righteous 5 save on that Brox exhaust. So, anyways, we are about to finish the GSXR 750 over here. It's making some good power. We're gonna see if we can uh, see if we can push it a little bit more. Though, see how much more we can get out of it. Just one more set of pulls here. We got the tune knocked out here on this GSX-R750. Got it just where we needed to be at. And we broke that elusive horsepower number that we was after. Let's check this right here out. 140.1 horsepower. I didn't think we was gonna make it. We kinda got stuck right around 139 and made a few little more changes and we got her just right. So 141 horsepower and 60 foot-pounds of torque. Not too shabby. I think she's gonna be doing pretty good. Customer will be back uh, later on to pick this thing right here up and we'll be able to find out from him how he's liking it. So anyways, we got this thing here knocked out though. If you have a 2011 till 2053, GSX-R 600 or 750, we can flash your ECU here at 57 Motorsports. Look down in the description below. You'll find some links to be able to contact us and we'll get you some information about how to get that thing shipped to us. Uh, get you a good flash tune into that thing right there. Make you some big power and we'll get that thing shipped back to you. Appreciate all y'all. Have a good one.